quick video here today again gonna keep, try to keep these videos as brief and concise as possible but aerodrome finance 47 cents here at the time of this video seeing some pretty consistent price just action here over the last I don't know it's only down 0.5 percent over the last seven days so has been relatively pretty even in price over the last month though however up still 476 percent i think it's important whenever you see a crypto go up significantly um and then kind of level out it's important to just zoom out on the chart you guys i think so many people you know actually had a comment on a previous aerodrome video talking about how um aerodrome's fud or aerodrome is a pump and dump sort of situation which is just i mean it's crazy um i think with any crypto project you're going to get those types of opinions types of um uh just voices talking about things like that but again if you do your research on a project and you believe in a project um n none of those things should pay you any mind but aerodrome 47 cents here at the time of this video again want to make this video as concise and brief as possible i'm going to put links to all the tweets that i do mention in this video um in the description below but yeah, let's just, uh, let's just get right into this. So first, this uh, tweet here by Checkmate Invest. Uniswap was launched late 2020 with approximately $6 billion total value locked. Arrow was launched in late 2023, and it already has $239 million TVL already. Do the math. Where's the opportunity? Um, and it, I mean, it's true, right? We talked about this in the previous video. The TVL for Arrow is already you know, significantly higher than as far as like pace goes for, for other um, LPs, you know, indexes. So it is interesting, right, when we think about the potential for Aerodrome moving forward, if it, the TVL continues to get bigger and bigger, um, and even what we talked about before with Aerodrome, with how what kind of separates it, um, it gives it a little bit more utility, it, is those uh, rewards, right, the VE rewards program, the VE Aero, um, you know, those rewards program, which, you know, voting incentives, the locking and the volume distributed, um, you know, and allocated and th th things like that. So you can see here, even just this tweet, um, Aerodrome Flight School Partner Program has begun. Flight School gives partners and lockers the ability to earn VE Aero monthly proportional to their participation in the protocol. The VE Aero lock bonus is currently estimated 0.12 VE Aero per Aero lock for this class, and so there's still time to join. Um, as you can see down here below, this like link brings you here. Um, so it's, it's pretty crazy. Like this is a very complex ecosystem. Um, obviously their website, in my opinion, is pretty easy to kind of grasp and understand. Um, I think they have a great website if you're just, you know, a first time looking at it, um, to a degree, obviously, you know, this is how the reward system kind of works. I broke it down in the previous video. Um, but again, it just goes to show you that there is differentiating factors between Aerodrome and like the Uniswap or Cake or, you know, other comparable LPs. Um, and then this tweet here as well, Diego underscore D77. Um, this is a tweet here from Brian Armstrong, or Brian Armstrong put this maybe on LinkedIn. I think payments are going to flow to the path of least resistance over time. Crypto rails are already starting to emerge with that. Now layer two is just coming online. So like inside Coinbase, only about 7% of our transactions are going over to layer two today. It should be about 99% at some point. It should be good for Arrow. Now, Arrow is obviously on base, right? on base we know again i don't want to keep pushing this narrative but coinbase did you know invest 100 plus million dollars into aerodrome so when you read things like this from the ceo of coinbase i think it really really benefits and, and kind of shows where coinbase probably sees aerodrome um in their plans i guess to a degree uh, moving forward in the future and then again i got to show the market cap of always for here for uh, arrow current if it had a six billion dollar market cap 19 dollars and 68 cents if it had a 25 billion dollar market cap 75 dollars um you know i think w without question not without question but in my opinion again not financial advice at all i think arrow could be in the realm of like a 10 to 20 billion dollar market cap in the born like easily like pretty easily in my opinion so we're talking about i mean i don't know what specific coin it is um Let's see what BTC is. Yeah, Bitcoin Cash, twenty-four dollars and eight billion dollar market cap. Um, let's go up a little more. Let's try. Let's just see the, you know, Uniswap. If it had the current market cap of Uniswap, ten billion, um, thirty-one dollars for Arrow, and then sixty-six dollars at a twenty-two billion dollar market cap. So you can just see kind of the potential, the X amount, the multiplier from that Arrow could go. Sixty-five X from the current price would be a ten billion dollar market cap. Which, again, in the bull run, everything coming together seems pretty attainable in my opinion at least again that is not financial advice so again drop a like on this video I'm gonna continue with these videos as well hit the subscribe button and as always have a great day